beginning. How long have you known Mr. Schaffner? Three days now. I met him the night that it happened. Is that right? I go to college in Freedom, about 20 miles east of here. And I was hitchhiking home one night, and Mr. Schaffner gave me a ride. And it was on your way home in his car that you had the sighting? Sighting? Mr. That thing was so close I could have touched it. Tell me about it. So me and young Peterson was just riding along. I hadn't picked him up more than 20 minutes before in Freedom. Anyway, I had just uh, tuned in some real good country western on the radio. Uh, when all of a sudden, the engine started to quit. And then the radio went dead. We come to a dead stop. It was about then that it happened. Too, boy. I ain't gonna let that thing kill me. You might expect a saucer to move flat, but this one was rolling right on its edge. What happened after it left? I flipped that key, and that engine kicked right over, just like there wasn't nothing wrong with it. Now, you remember, I told you that saucer killed that engine dead. So I dropped Danny off at his house and went on home. Did you report this to the police? Nope. I know who to report matters like this to. 
Waited till the next day, then I called your people. Sure did have to push them to get you out here. You know that rifle I told you about? Show it to him, Mr. Shaffner. Here it is. I wonder if we might borrow that rifle for a few days. What for? We'd like to send it to our lab. We'll have it back to you shortly. I'll tell you what you do. Stop by my place in about an hour, 34 Elm Street. Gonna have to take a picture of this gun before I turn it over to you. Property identification. You know. Yes, sir. Look at that thing. I ain't no good to somebody unless they want to shoot their foot off. like a letter of confirmation from the Air Force. You'll hear from us, Mr. Schaffner, one way or another. I want that letter. You just put it all in writing. We'll run you home. Thanks. Quite a character, isn't he? You told it to me straight, didn't you, Danny? Yes, sir, I did. I know you told Sergeant Fitz, but go over it once more for me on the way. Do you mind? You don't believe us, do you? For us, it's just a matter of getting the best evidence we can. We just want to be sure, Danny. We just want to be sure we got it all straight. I can't give it to you any straighter, sir. It's the pure truth. straight up both times, when he told me and when he told you on the way out here. And right on target with Schaffner. Okay, 34 Elm Street. Then what? Meantime, back to Denver. Yeah. Inter-America Airlines. Mm -hmm. 